off on another hunt and you know what that song's so good I should keep that song going while I uh, get ready here for the hunt <laughs> Man, you should even hear the next part of that song. It's so good. I gotta play that song more. Anyways, uh, what are we doing? Getting ready for a hunt here. It's evening. Gotta sleep into the next day. I've got the feeling here. The urge just to shoot something. Go for some marksmanship here. Gonna grab the 223. That's all I'm gonna bring. Nah, might bring some collars. Maybe. Maybe not. Maybe. I don't know. Uh, we'll grab that one. What else is out there? Elk call, predator call. Uh, we'll grab the key PIA call here. There we go. Uh, yeah. Uh, so I think that's all we're gonna bring. All right, we're gonna sleep into the next day here. Uh, should be an exciting day actually because it's the last day of a year, and that's when I gotta. Keep an eye out for all these four stars that are going to roll over to be a five star. There we go. Uh, let's see now. The target today. This is just going to be a normal hunt. I'm not doing any kind of science or anything like that. I'm not going to be a stress roll or anything like that. I still want to clear out this area down here, which I have before because there's a campsite or something. Lost my save or whatnot. Because mm, I can't really. Isn't there like two campsites in here? I don't have anything close. Uh, because you go down here to this cab and you get, there's no quick way to get around there. Is this a campsite? Man, I don't have anything unlocked. Let's, uh, well, let's just go to this guy, I guess. And just go southeast and hunt on the way down. I guess I should really go for this because I think this is a campsite. Let's set that as target. We'll go through uh, some uh, deer country here on the way. I don't think I'm going to bother with uh, the toolbox at the moment. Just going to listen and see what we hear here. I got my headphones on for the first time in a while. So I can actually hear the game for a change. Might be neat to hear the sounds. Uh, but that's all I'm planning. It is, uh, you know, 7 in the morning or whatever now. And, yep, just going to head southeast here, see what we run, run into. Practice some shot placement with the little, little uh, 223 here. I actually had to back up here because look how gorgeous this is coming over the hill. Just the sun. Sunbeams bouncing off of everything. Ah, uh, it looks so great. It took a while for me to kind of warm up to the graphics in this game, but. Uh, during the morning here, in the evenings, when the sun goes down and the sun comes up, looks really good. Alright, we've got 230 meter mule deer herd hanging out here. Let's see if I can plop the arrow down in the right spot. Not anywhere close. Try there. That's better. Alright, let's go check them out. This will be an interesting little approach here. Steep cliffside. And they're in here somewhere. No, no visual on them. That is pretty heavy stuff in there. Getting close now. Uh, wind is perfect. And river's going to get stuck on this hill here. The slope. Hopefully get a little brighter. Sun maybe get a little higher here. Does my flashlight help? Maybe even have that on or the headlight on here. So they should be right up here. I am hanging out just in hiker like normal these days. I'm not gonna 
worry about too much sneaking. I want to get in close though. I like getting in close. I don't like using the collars these days. Just for now. Getting getting my little lower uh, frame drop in these early morning hours. Hopefully that'll get sorted out as well. Well, they should be pretty close. Oh yeah, I can hear them. But I don't see them. I think I'm just being blind. Are they just over here? Yeah. Yeah, they're like right here. Must be just a little slope right there. Do a little quick start and stops here. Even this close and uneasy, you gotta take your time a bit. Oh yeah, I know I've got the, the collar and everything, but I just find it more enjoyable trying to sneak up to them here. Let's use the camera for a second, because I think they're right... Yeah, right here. They're just over... There's a couple to the left I might be able to see. Man, that's heavy. Can't get anything. With the headphones, I get to uh, practice a bit with the directional sound in the game, which I don't do much anymore. I just remember it being a little on the weak side, not being able to pinpoint where the sounds are coming from. I should be spooking them soon, even on Hiker. Well, we'll pause for a minute. Any sort of alert meter that is built up should be going down to nothing. Oh, here we go. One star adult. So he's got the little defensive mode going on. Anybody else? Sure sounds like there there's more coming this way. Oh. Are they spooking? No, oh, I just hear a whole lot of a whole lot of stomping. They must be going away, are they? Yeah, I think I think they're cruising away. Well, maybe he walked around. Yeah, he probably walked around uh, behind me enough, did he? He was there. Oh no, he couldn't have caught the. Oh, they left one behind. Well, that must have been uh, hunting pressure due to vision, which I don't see very often at all. So he obviously saw me. I don't think they went alert, did they? They just decided to bug out? Huh. That's interesting. So that was, uh, that was me being spotted. You see how close he was. Now he was in defensive mode, but, uh, yeah, it would have registered as, uh, me being seen there. But without spooking. Oh, there they go. Oh, well. I think there's probably some low fits in there. It's really challenging hunting in here. Don't know if I can track them down or not. My goal was to go that way. Not get too distracted here. 
Well, they probably didn't go too far. I should be able to hear them here shortly, except the wind's going this way. I guess we'll find out. Yeah, I'm not actually too sure what that was. He, uh... I must have triggered the alert on him due to being spotted, and I guess he just told the others. Say, get out of here. River's here. Alright, I think I located them. They went 300 meters. I mean, that... I guess they alerted, then spooked, so... At least I think this is the same group, unless it's a... Uh, different mule deer herd I just ran into. Now, it's still really dark here. The sun is hitting that hillside over there, but we're on the wrong side here for light. I like starting at 7 in the morning, get a full full day in. Which uh, won't be in the full video, because it would be a very long video if I did that. 7 to 7 or something. Well, I thought I heard them here. Yeah, I definitely like it being brighter. Lights? Yeah, there's a zone right here. It's, there was sound right here. Okay, maybe they were moving? Oh, they're right here. I don't know if this is the same group or not. Looks a bit smaller. Oh, so dark though. Yeah, see? That could be a new group. Certainly challenging all the time here in Nez. In these uh, forested areas with low light. Ooh, where do you got those wolves from? Gee, they're not too far away either. I'm not sure I'm going to try and approach wolves, though. That might be a caller thing. Yeah, they're right here. Man. Every <laughs> every time I try here, I'm just over like a little slope or something where I can't see them. That was the wind. The wind is that way. Not super great. Oh, there's one. If I can see a few more. There's one there, but I can't get Hunter Sense read on him. Oh, who's this guy? Oh, here we go. Mature female. There's one star mature right there. Oh, no, this one. What a fun angle that is. 57 meters. Man, I should have stayed on the other side of the hill where the light is better. I don't think the wind's going to matter too much here. 50 meters. Uh, not much shot with the 223 here. Rear leg artery shot. Always an option, but we got no cavity damage really with this. We're going to have to keep an eye on him. It's going to have to move. I could attempt a brain shot, I suppose. Maybe he'll turn. Oh, he's turning. Perfect. Alright. 50 meters, 223. I guess we'll go solid in here. Oh, he's going to armor up with the tree. Okay, we'll give it a whirl here. 
Oh, a little stutter there in that shot. So it would have connected with the lung, as long as my little stutter didn't throw me out. Hopefully they get some of that optimization out here sooner rather than later. So it's a one star mature, we'll see what we did. Well, it doesn't look like very much blood. Oh yes it is, good. There we go. So we'll give him a second, I think the wolves all ran as well. Oh good, here he is. He didn't make it too far. So I guess this is going to be a, a left lung knockout and some damage to the right lung. Definitely didn't look very big. Yep, pretty much. Ooh, higher than I thought though. I guess I had a much higher angle on him than I thought as well. That's what happens with the low light. 223, all you need though, 14%. Alright, let's sell him off. And I'm going to get somewhere where it's uh, brighter here. Because this is just too dark. Let's mark that again. Ah, but I just ran into the often rest zone for an elk herd. Checked out the map here. Not the toolbox, but it looks like I've located most of these zones. And I'll be running into... They should be at a feed zone, moving out to a drink zone. So I'm not going to go up to these ones, it's just I'll get them if, they, if they're down here. Oh good, I can see again. It doesn't appear that they are at this feed zone. Maybe they already moved out. Down to that drink maybe? Yeah, it's a rare one. Alright, so they're going to be at this one. I mean, we should be able to intercept them if they're coming down to this drink. So let's go there. Maybe they're already down there. Gotta keep the ears open. So I wonder... Yeah, so they're gonna be at the other feed. Nope, mark that there. And we'll clear these out for just a second. It should be along that line. Maybe we'll be able to see the game trail. Oh, more distractions. 170 meter white tailed deer. Okay, let's check them out. Maybe the elk are coming this way. I was going to walk towards them and see if I could meet them. Uh, but let's, uh, attempt these guys here. It is really challenging hunting in all these, uh, this wooded area. Well, without using collars, it's, uh, challenging. Just because you gotta get close enough to get a visual on them, wherever they are. And I do have the collar, but yeah, we're gonna try and do this without it. Yeah, I think it's just a small squad here. See if I can get up here enough. See if the range changes and updates. Yeah, 50 meters. I'm right right at them here. Yep, I can start hearing them walking here. Let's see if I can get up close enough. Might be spooking them. Well, they seem to be stirred up. Not spooked. I wonder if I've been detected and they're going to come walking out at me. Let's see. Definitely doing something. What are you guys doing? Just standing there stomping? Oh, there's a lot of you. Oh, now I, I really want to get visual on all these guys. Uh, none of them look really big though, but uh, no matter. Still target practice. They're really close, so... See if we can sneak up here. Alright, I gotta be super close right now. 
This is why I like the hiker difficulty. Any other difficulty would have spooked him by now with my impatience. But at least you can... You stand a chance here getting close. So the hiker difficulty is really good for the bow hunting and the crossbowing. But, you know, if you want to do close range rifle shots, then... It's good too. Okay, I'm going to pause for just a second. Because the alert meter still builds, and but it also... Uh, decreases quickly as well. So it builds slower, but decreases quicker. And hiker, so you don't need to pause so long. I mean, I should be detected by now. I'm kind of expecting one to come out and be defensive here. You're right. They're right there. Oh. Yeah. So this one's checking out just a young female. See, I gotta move, but she's right there. So it might end up being what I just did. Look at the other one. Like they they might just spot me and move out. Yeah, something's happening. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Same kind of thing. So. Well, hunting pressure was applied, they're going to relocate. We'll see what they do. Nobody's really big here. But we'll leave them alone. Kind of watch them, see what they do. This guy looks kind of older. Yeah, here's a good one, probably. Oh, are they going to do their zombie thing? Yeah, I think they're doing their zombie thing. Just kind of walk straight, really slow. There. Oh, tails are all up. So what's their status? Oh, it is showing alerted. Okay. Well, the alert should drop, though. Oh, it did. There it goes. Two star mature. Oh, there's a one star right there. Let's get him quick. Yeah, they're doing their weird walk. Ooh, quartering away a bit. So we'll fire a little bit back in. Oh, it's an interesting time to turn. But yeah, they're doing their weird zombie thing. Buddy, Let's see if we can sneak this one in. <laughs> yeah, he's gonna go down. Two, two, three. Got it again. I've almost caught up to him. I don't think they ran much farther than he is. Yeah, they're there here, and he's right up here. Yeah, let's see how I did on that shot. Right lung. Yeah, it's okay. A bit high. Didn't make it to the other lung. Stopped in the middle. Yeah, too steep of an angle. Ah, oh, not bad. That works anyways. For 223, 41%. Get a few dollars for him. Now, I might as well take a look at the rest of them, if they're more in the open now. Let's see. Maybe get some elevation here. They're over here somewhere. Oh, stick snap. Always just over the next little slope. Uh, the elk. Oh, did I spook him? Looks like I did, yeah. That's me, even on hiker. Yeah, gotta be slow. There they go. Just trying to see if any trotted out here. 
Nope, must all cleared out. Are you already calling, or is this another herd? Huh. Alright, let's check on that one. I don't know if this is the herd I spooked or another one. But regardless, it's the direct direction that I wanted to go. I think that campsite's up there. And this is the drink zone for the elk, but they're not here yet, so they they must have been just these two spots. So I got a little unlucky there. But these are probably their rare drinking feed zones. We got a rare white tail drink. And back into the trees we go again. To do the struggle. Trying to get visual on these guys. Got a stick break. 110 meters. Hmm, how do we do this one? That hill, maybe? I think that's the best bet. There's one of them there. Yep, they're they're right beyond this hill here. <laughs> no matter what I do, they're always behind something. Well, I imagine I'll spook them again, because I think there isn't really much of uh, a harvest in there. No, I'll see if I can get up here without spooking them. So I'm really close, so we will go right down to that slow sneak and pause and let them reset a bit. Okay, I gotta be right there. It's like I can never get to the top. Hmm, hello. Oh, yep. There we go. Yeah, so it's the same group. It's just this two-star guy. Probably take him out, because he's not going to make it. Much larger, but... You know, there's no point either way. He's probably sitting right at that 60% mark. Which is almost right on the average anyways. Oh, what have we got here? I think everything else is young. Oh, well, yeah, we might as well take him out since he's right here. Look how close I am. I definitely didn't need... This uh, 18 times scope for what I'm doing here. Uh, so this shot should actually be a little low because the bullet will still be climbing. <laughs> Look how zoomed in. <laughs> well, I can do like a precision heart shot maybe. Now it's going to be a little low. Heart will be about here. And that's how we do that. Sneaking nice and close. That's how I like doing it these days. Should have brought the crossbow or something. Oh, bang on was I on that heart. Right down the middle almost. Nice. 55%. Pretty much by my math, that is the average that they all start at, 55%. He's right on the middle of the road. Doesn't matter if he was here or not. He wasn't raising the average or lowering it. So, a good take there. And then, let's just go up the hill here. If I can clear this, there we go. Just grab whatever this is. I'm pretty sure it's a campsite. So the destination's right here, but I have deer. Only from way down there. So this must be a heavy 
Definitely looks like a heavy drop off. Oh, what? Is it really down there? Is it down there? Or is it at the top here? Okay, well, I'm gonna need a parachute to get down from there. Let's try this way. Oh, what is going on here? Is this a way down? I spooked them anyways. Oh! I see, oh, never mind. And River wasn't found for two years. <laughs> okay. I've gotten that before, but I can't really remember it. Must be just down there. Alright, so what we'll do is... What will we do now? Well, this is a cool spot up here. Uh, so... This is the Kissing Rocks or something? And I don't remember if I did ever go here. Maybe I did. But what a cool little spot this is. Can do a... Little drone spin around here. That's pretty cool. Just taking a bunch of screenshots. This is a cool spot. There was some white tail down here, though. They might have moved on while I was poking around with the camera. Maybe they're coming down here to drink? What time is it? Ten? Well, if anybody comes to this lake to drink that's tier five... They should be here. Not too, too long. Oh, well, there's the call. Oh, maybe they're heading there. Is that what you guys are doing? A lot of white tail out here. Another two star mature. Probably going to be sitting right at that 55 60%. Another two star. Mature female. Well. Might as well take down one of these bucks since they're not helping nor hindering. You can always just do a doe, but no real point there either. Alright. Let's make sure not to get the adult. It's 200 meters in the shade. Wind's going at him, but I'm way too far, I think. 200 meter, 223 shot. This one. Could be interesting. So here is the one that is the younger guy. Here's the other. Might be doing this guy since he's the closest and broadside. Oh, that guy's quartering away okay. What's the range on him? 225. I have to wait till they stop. That's going to be not a good shot when he's moving. He's going to be quartering away. Quartering away is okay, though, with the 223 here. It's just, I don't want to do a moving shot. The The bullet travel time is slower than you'd think in this game. And it's got to be a precision shot with the 223 here, so. Be about 230 there. Are they going to walk all the way around the lake? Watch them not drink at the lake and they'll be drinking, say, way over here or something. Which makes kind of more sense, because they shouldn't be here this early. I bet you they are. I bet you they're traveling around the lake. Oh, what to do. I don't think they're really going to pause, are they? Oh, that guy's sort of pausing. One looks darker than the other one. This guy's darker. So this guy's got another year in him. There we go. So what's our range again? A little bit up. Wind's right at him. Oh, can you do a hard shot from here? I gotta think about this. He's gonna see, I don't got much time, though. Okay, he's gonna walk again. I'm gonna consider doing a hard shot. He's definitely the oldest one. This guy's not as mature. This guy's last year. I bet you he's... This guy's gonna die off uh, in one sleep. So definitely... 
Can take them. We go at 250 now. I don't really want to chase him though, so. This could be a while before they decide to stop where they are. I do want to attempt a heart shot <laughs> from this far with the 223. Probably a bad idea though. But I'm not sure it's going to have the oomph at over 200 meters for the lung. Could be interesting. Okay, the doe is stopping. They're catching up. Okay, he's going to encounter the water here. Maybe he'll pause there. Yep, encounter the you. Look at this guy. Right in the way. Right in the way. What are we at now? 250? Oh, man. I almost want to go to 300. And shoot a tad low. Just a tad. Okay, visualize the heart. Visualizing the heart. There's lots of blood. Yeah, he's going to go down. Not the heart, though. All right, I'll mark about there. Hey, okay. very cool. I never did get my fast travel point I wanted, though. All right, we got to get down from here, though, without... Uh, Without dying. This is no doubt stupid. <laughs> I could just take the Jeep down. I figure, hey, could be fun. Think I can slide down there without dying? No, 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 don't, don't. Ah, oh, I thought maybe, maybe he could do it. I guess not. All right, not a big deal. All right, we just uh, drove back here. I think I spooked them all when I drove in. Yeah, not a big deal. I'm curious how this shot went. But it should just be the left lung knockout here. He ran way too far for the heart. Still curious though. And here he is. Ouch, he says. See how I did there. Yep, one lung. Oh, went into the next lung too. So, I aimed low because I thought it was going to go high, and it still went higher than I thought. Went much higher, too, because I, uh, I pulled the trigger and the reticle was down here. Hmm, it climbed more. I guess it's downhill, too. But I don't know if the game cares about if it's up or down with its physics. Hmm. Oh, well, yeah, not even near the heart. But yeah, I, I pulled down here, I think. Oh, well. Did the job anyways, 258 meters. 59, yep, 60, so that's me. Two-star mature on these mule deer and white-tailed deer. You're usually, you're usually hitting 55, 60 percent or something. So they can just be taken out. And he would have been in his last year anyways. So... All right, so that's good, and the hunt, I'm only at 11 a.m., so my next hunt, I could just pick up and start hunting tier 6 animals uh, at the drink time. Uh, but that'll be it uh, for this episode, uh, so like always, let me know what you think, and uh, if you have any questions, fire away in the comment section. I think that's the same herd I spooked there, so no big deal there. But uh, yeah, happy hunting guys, take care, see you in the next one.